Hello everyone, welcome to another lecture of the course Digital Signal Processing. In the previous lectures, we have seen how to design a low pass filter using windowing technique and a fire low pass filter using windowing technique. And for that, what we had done was we had considered H of N that is the desired low pass filter that, I, that is obtained from the ideal low pass filter multiplied by a window function that is W of N. So this is the ideal low pass filter and this W of N is the window. We have also seen some of the specifications for this W of N. Now after doing truncation or after obtaining this H of N, if we look at the range of this H of N, range rather domain that is the range of this N, it is all the way from minus of M by 2 to M by 2. Which means that this H of N still is a non-causal filter. And to make this H of N a causal filter, so to make this H of N a causal filter, that is to make the range of N from 0 to M, what we need to do is introduce a delay of M by 2 units. So for making it a causal filter, we need to introduce a delay of m by 2 units. So basically what we need to have is h of n minus m by 2. So by introducing this delay we are going to obtain the causal filter. So what we want is h of n to be converted to h of n minus m by 2 and this h of m minus m by 2 can be given as h ideal of n minus m by 2 that is the delayed version of the ideal filter multiplied by w of n minus m by 2. So this is the delayed version of the ideal filter that is delay ideal filter by m by 2 as well as delaying this window function by again m by 2. Now if we look at this ideal filters equation, so if we look at h ideal of n, it is given as sine of omega c n divided by pi n and this is valid for n not equal to 0 and for n equal to 0 we have omega c by pi. So this is value is for n equal to 0 and this omega c, this omega c is the cutoff frequency. Now if we obtain the delayed version of this filter that is h ideal of n minus m by 2. So what we have is sine of omega c into n minus m by 2. And now this is uh, n 
साइन ऑफ ओमेगा सी इंटू एन माइनस एम बाई टू डिवाइडेड बाय पाए ऑफ एन माइनस एम बाई टू एंड नाउ दिस इज वैलिड नॉट एट एन इक्वल टू एम बाई टू सो दिस इक्वेशन और दिस फंक्शन इज वैलिड फॉर ऑल द वैल्यूज ऑफ एन दैट आर नॉट इक्वल टू एम बाई टू एंड फॉर एन इक्वल टू एम बाई टू द वैल्यू इज ओमेगा सी अपॉन पाए सो दिस इज एट एन इक्वल टू एम बाई टू सो नाउ वी हैव डीलेड द आइडियल लो पास फिल्टर नाउ द सेकेंड थिंग दैट वी नीड टू फाइंड इज द डीलेड वर्जन ऑफ द विंडो फंक्शन सो द विंडो फंक्शन दैट इज डब्ल्यू ऑफ एन इज ऑल्सो टू बी डीलेड दैट इज वी वॉन्ट डब्ल्यू ऑफ एन माइनस एम बाई टू सो लेट इज कंसिडर द एग्जाम्पल ऑफ हैनिंग विंडो सो कंसिडर हैनिंग विंडो एंड द एक्सप्रेशन फॉर हैनिंग विंडो इज गिवन एज डब्ल्यू ऑफ एन इज इक्वल टू पॉइंट फाइव प्लस पॉइंट फाइव इंटू कॉस ऑफ टू पाए एन अपॉन एम Now, if we need to delay this function, that is, what we need to find is W of n minus m by two. So, what we have is point five plus point five into cos of two pi by m into n minus m by two. Now, if we simplify it, what we get is point five. Plus zero point five into cos of two pi n upon m minus pi. So this m cancels with this m. This m cancels with this m, and this two with this two. So what we are left with is only two pi n by m minus pi. Now cos of anything. So cos of theta minus pi. That is. cos of theta minus pi is given as minus of cos of theta so same thing we are going to do here so what we have is the delayed version is given as 0.5 minus 0.5 cos of 2 pi n upon m so this is the equation for the window in order to obtain a causal filter now there would be some changes in the expressions of other windows also so let us look at that so for causal filters for designing causal filters the window functions are for rectangular window there would won't be any kind of change but for hanning window it would be 0.5 minus 0.5 cos of 2 pi n upon m but now this n will be varying from 0 to m where this m is the order now again the hamming window will be given as 0.54 minus 0.46 cos of 2 pi n upon m the bartlett window will be given as 1 minus 2 times mod of n minus m by 2 upon m the blackman window will be given as 0.42 minus 0.5 cos of 2 pi n upon m plus 0.08 cos of 2 pi uh, cos of 4 pi n upon m so in this lecture what we have seen is for designing a low uh, designing a causal filter we need to introduce a delay of m by 2 units where this m is the order so this m is the order of the filter now if we introduce the delay in the filter that is h of n delayed by m by 2 so what we have is h of n minus m by 2 so it can be very well given as h ideal of n minus m by 2 into w of n minus m by 2 where this h ideal is the ideal low pass filter and this w is nothing but the window function now the shifted version or the delayed version of the ideal filter is given as sin of omega c into n minus m by 2 upon pi of 
pi into n minus m by 2 where this n is not equal to m by 2 whereas it is omega c upon pi for n equal to m by 2. We have also seen the expressions for various windows for the causal filter case that is for rectangular Hanning, Hamming, Bartlett, Blackman windows we have seen the expressions for causal filters. So in this lecture we have basically seen how to design a causal filter using the expression for the ideal filter and the window function. So let's stop here. Thank you.